What's up guys, Pronto here, getting into some more Detroit Lions franchise. Michael Vick, we're taking on the Eagles, and he's 3-for-3 three three on the season. LaShawn McCoy, uh, about 200 yards on the season so far. Receiving, they still got Deshaun Jackson, uh, Brent Selleck, and uh, as long with Steve Smith, uh, Jamal Dickerson, and uh, the rest of them, they're all there. Um, not too many big names out there, but somebody asked this a long time ago, and I decided to check it out. Did Ben Jarvis Green Ellis fumble? Yes, he did. Many times. Nine fumbles so far. He's still in the paths. Uh, Vince Young here, as we're getting about midseason here, well, week six, so about a third of the way. Uh, there's Vince Young's stats. Uh, Javid Best, 318 yards on the season. Calvin Johnson getting the bulk of the reception yards, of course, because we just love hitting him. And uh, he's actually only got 20. He's only got 10 receptions up on Pettigrew, but 400 yards on him, so that's pretty good. Jordan Carey, uh, he just started catching him last game, pretty much. There's Keith Rivers leading in tackles, and that's why I got him. He's the best. He's the best. Not the best, but he's good. Chris Houston, he's on fire. Two interceptions in his last game. Uh, so he's going to try to keep it going here as Mike Vick taking this one on first down. Brought down by Cliff Averill. That's a great way to start the game. Second and 17, Michael Vick. He's going to scramble. He just shoves off Kiesel. And that he's going to take it up there as uh, Sharice Wright is going to bring him down. So on first and 10 here, Michael Vick in shotgun. We're going to try to bring him down again. But he hands off to LaShawn McCoy. Runs over Stephen Tullock. Takes it up there, and that's a nine-yard gain on the play. Mike Vick, he drops back, fires it in to Steve Smith. That's going to be a first down for the Eagles. Now second and three, Michael Vick. He decides to scramble, but Kiesel says, uh-uh. He ain't getting past me again. He gets the sack, so it's going to be third and nine. And he's dropping back here, firing it to a wide-open Steve Smith for a second. Third down conversion and a second grab of the game. And now Sharice Wright coming at him off the side, but he gets the throw off to Selleck, and that's going to be a uh, reception for 24 yards, bringing him to the four-yard line. First and goal, handoff goes to LaShawn McCoy. He gets hit, but he falls into the end zones for their touchdown early. Uh, their first drive just happened to be a touchdown. Third and seven for us, we complete a play to Calvin Johnson. Now second and nine for Andrew Lee, who's starting this game because he did so well against the Redskins. Hits Mark Clayton, and that's going to be a first down. Second and 10 now. Enderley drops back, fires it into Calvin Johnson. He, that's going to be another first down on the board, so we're starting to roll here. Second and five. Toss out right goes to Best, and he can't get past the other man. I was trying to get that blocker to hit him, but he just wouldn't. Best gets injured on the play. Brandon Jacobs is in because Best is out for the rest of the game. So Brandon Jacobs is in and he just gets stuck on the linebacker. I mean the offensive lineman's butt. And fourth and inches we decide to go for it. And I'll be sure that was a first down. But it's a first down for them. So uh, they end up going three and out. And uh, we're in the second now. Mark Clayton getting the reception on first down. Give us another first down. Then we hand it off to Brandon Jacobs. Sheds off a tackle. Takes it up. That's an eight-yard gain on the play. We'll see what he can do this game. Test him out as Enderly is sacked. Cole with the fumble recovery. And that's going to be huge hitting us. Uh, so Mike Vick here in shotgun. Play action to LaShawn McCoy. And he's going to fire this one. But is batted down and Nate Allen picks it off. And that is a good play for us right there as we get it back. Turnover for turnover, so that's all right. As we hand it off to Brandon Jacobs here, he takes it up. Another nine-yard gain right there. Another big gain for him. As we go play action now, Andrew Lee rolls to his right. Fires it in. Calvin Johnson shaking off a defender and picks it up for some yards after that catch. First down now, third and ten. Enderley in shotgun. Drops back. He's going to fire to Brandon Pettigrew, who gets hit hard. And is it going to be a first down? We shall see. It is. So first and ten now for Enderley. And he is brought down yet again, and he fumbles it yet again. Horrible, horrible play right there. You got to hold on when he gets sacked. You're going to get sacked, but you just got to hold on. So third and five. Vic is going to throw the screen pass to LaShawn McCoy, and that's going to be a first down, somehow making it past every Detroit Lion on the field there. So first and 10, handoff McCoy again. He is brought down on the play, 
but after a six-yard gain. So after a one-yard loss, third and five, they fired in to Macklin. That's his first reception on the game for 11 yards. Third and 11 now. Vic going to be looking to convert yet again as he's moving around in the pocket. And you got to do something with that as he just crosses the line of scrimmage and he's hit. So that's not going to be a sack. But they do kick a field goal right there as right there Vince Young showing some inaccuracy. He was in for Enderley and that's not a good way to start it off Vince. Uh, so they get a first down right here nearing the red zone. Michael Vick dropping back. He's going to fire this one into Selleck, and he spins off a defender and takes that up for a first down. So first and 10. Now I see it's Wildcat. They hand it off to Macklin, and he is going to cut, spin off a defender, and take it into the end zone. A very good showcase right there of uh, agility and some strength on that one as well to stay up after getting hit. So uh, it ends up being a couple three and outs, and we get into the late minutes of the third quarter as Michael Vick scrambling away from the pressure he is brought down by Nick Fairley that's going to be a fourth and 19 so they're gonna to have to punt it away they're up 17 to nothing and now with one minute left in the third Vince Young brought down by Jenkins and that's gonna be a huge loss third and 18 looking for a conversion Vince Young moving around finds Calvin Johnson that's gonna be a first down right there second and 10 now we're in the fourth quarter that could have been a huge play, but that one is overthrown. So it's going to be third and 10 now for Young. He's in the shotgun a lot this game. And that one was actually intended for, I believe, Skinner. Uh, but Calvin Johnson picks it up off the inaccurate throw. And here we're going to lob it up to Brandon Jacobs. He takes it in for the first down. So we're rolling here. We're trying to get it on the board for once in the fourth quarter. Brandon Jacobs takes the draw. He's going to take it up there, and that's going to be a four-yard gain on the play, injuring an Eagles defender in the process. And then he's going to try to throw it in to his man, Calvin, and uh, that one's going to be batted down. So third and six, firing it up, and that one is going to be batted down yet again. So we tack on a field goal, get on the board at least, but we got to pick it up to be able to get back in this game. McCoy takes it up for eight yards on the play. It's going to be third and three now. Vic's going to hand off to McCoy, who gets hit, sheds off the tackle though, and he takes it up for a first down on the play. It's going to be first and ten now. McCoy takes the handoff. He is dropped down by Nick Fairley and company, second and four. Uh, Vic drops back, and he's going to be thrown to the ground by Nick Fairley, his second sack of the game. So now it's going to be at third and 11 for Vic and the Eagles in shotgun, under pressure, moving around in the pocket, and he's finally hit as he throws. So they're going to have to punt this one away. Second and 10 now, Enderly. He's going to find Papa Skinner. He's back in the game, by the way, and uh, that's going to be a first down because he made that big late game winning stretch against the Redskins so we can see if we'll do it again here today first and 10 he converts and now third and 10 Enderly rolls out to his left and makes a beautiful throw to Papa Skinner to reel that one in that was great second and goal now Enderly rolls out to his right and he's just gonna call his own number but he gets stopped at the one yard line so on third and goal here we punch it in with Brandon Jacobs and uh, it took a couple of tries, but we punched in it. So we're only down by a touchdown. Three minutes left. First and ten. Handoff goes LaShawn McCoy. He's dropped by Justin Durant on the play. That's only a one-yard gain. So second and nine now. I'm expecting a run, of course. They're looking to get some first downs. LaShawn McCoy dropped yet again. This time by, well, this time by Justin Durant. Um, third and seven now. Run goes to McCoy again, and he is brought down. And that is going to be a huge stop for our defense. So on 4th and 4 here, kicks up to Leon Washington, sheds off a tackle and goes to his right. And he's only got one man to beat, and he does beat him, but he gets dropped by the kicker, I believe. Flag on the play, though. Watch this. This is the most horrible clipping call uh, Monty Glover could have done. Watch your bottom right screen here, number 27. He was not even in the play. Why would you do that? Screwing us over. We're on the 25-yard line after that punt return. So now we're on the 46. Andrew trying to make up for it. Mark Clayton gets the reception. That's going to be a first down. So on the 44-yard line in their territory, first and 10, Andrew drops way back, keeping this one deep. Papa Skinner end zone. 
cannot come up with the grab. So that's going to put us at second and 10. Enderly is going to fire to Calvin Johnson, trying to get another game tying drive. Well, a game winning drive against the Redskins, but now a game tying. And that one's going to be incomplete there to Calvin Johnson, intended for. So second and 10. Enderly under pressure as the blitz comes. And that one is almost picked off. Third and 10 now. We got to get a conversion here. We only got two more plays left in us. Calvin Johnson Jr. makes the catch. That's a huge catch to the eight yard line. They had to take a timeout as well. First and goal, Enderly. Under pressure, nobody is open, sacked. So that takes us to the 17 yard line. Third and goal. Let's get another touchdown. Let's get a comeback. And Enderly fires it in for Calvin. That one's going to be incomplete. So fourth and goal. We got to get it right here. This is it. End zone or bust. Enderly throws it up for Calvin. And that was too many men in the end zone. They were prepared for that one. Uh, There's nothing I could do about that one. I had to get extremely lucky to get an open man in that end zone. So we finish off this game. It was pretty close though. Every game this year I've had is very, very close. Uh, the final score here as they'll show at over Ford Field, 17 to 10 for the Eagles. Thank you for watching, guys. I will see you in the next video. Peace out.